California, one in five workers is without a job and another rent check is due tomorrow. Now desperate renters are demanding help ahead of a nationwide protest. KPI x Katie Nielsen has some new numbers showing just how hard Bay Area tenants have been hit by the pandemic. The data just released shows what so many people in the Bay Area are already feeling. Rents are high and there's not a lot of money left over at the end of the month. With so many people now out of work because of the coronavirus, it's making an already difficult situation almost impossible. I won't be making that rent payment tomorrow because I don't have it. Marika Reagan owns City Hikes, a once thriving dog walking and pet care business in the East Bay. She says as soon as the shelter in place order was announced, her business came to a screeching halt. Text message after text message from clients. We don't need walks. I'll be home. Don't need um, canceling my, my pet sitting because my trip is canceled. She now only has three clients, barely enough income to pay some of her utilities and buy groceries. There's nothing left over for rent. If my, no money is coming in, where am I supposed to be getting that from? A similar situation for so many people across the Bay Area who are also out of work. According to new numbers released from UC Berkeley's Turner Center for Housing Innovation, there are more than a quarter million households in San Francisco, Oakland, and Berkeley where the ability to pay rent is impacted by COVID-19. Looking at the average cost of rent and the minimum monthly unemployment benefits, including $600 a month from the CARES Act, the cost of rent would eat up 82% of those minimum unemployment benefits. In the South Bay, there are about 125,000 households impacted, and based on the same formula, rent would take up about 93% of the benefits. It's for a lot of people impossible, just barely surviving, everyone in survival mode. Marika says at this point, something has to be done. There's power in numbers. Don't get scared, don't get angry, organize. Tenants' rights advocates are calling for a national rent strike tomorrow, asking people not to pay their rent in hopes it will put pressure on political leaders to come up with some type of a relief plan. In San Jose, Katie Nielsen, KPIX 5.